Sebastian, you're being an idiot. I don't need you to come with me. Yes, but to refute that, this is literally the dumbest idea I've ever heard. Like, I may drop 20 IQ points from being around this stupid ass idea. Well, you don't need to be that mean. Apparently I do, because here we are. I was just thinking. About what? The same stuff as before. You know, you two have been separated for quite some time, and maybe she isn't as... Well, yeah, you're right. But I know this is going to sound so selfish and stupid, but if she is intelligent and she can make friends, then she's going to make a million of them, and then what is she going to need me for? Yeah, you're right. This is stupid. She's your sister, and she's not going to get rid of you that easily. You're being paranoid, and you're underestimating your importance in her life. How do you think she felt when she realized you weren't there? You saw her texting calls. Exactly. So you need to calm down and start thinking a little bit more rationally. Take time to think things through. Like, are you sure you want to get on a train right now? And do you even have money? Yeah, I... I swear, I, I had some... You looking for this? It, how the hell did you get that? I picked your pocket when you were leaving. <laughs> you don't look like the kind of person who knows how to pickpocket. Yeah, it's kind of a skill that I mostly grew out of, but it's kind of like riding a bicycle. You never really forget. And you never get caught. <laughs> no, I've definitely gotten into some trouble. <laughs> you are full of surprises today. Yeah, I try my best to amuse you. So, are you really going to get on a train right now? Well, I can't let you still have my money, but you're right, I shouldn't go alone. My favorite phrase. What, I shouldn't go alone? No, you're right. <coughs> Smart ass. <laughs> you know, we should really find a proper train right now. You're right. <laughs> Music to my ears. Music to my ears.